Hello everyone, it's Anna from Anna's Paper Creations and I have another guest design team project to share with you and it's uh, for Pion Design and that is a Swedish uh, company and I will put the link here below to the website where you can find the store finder and also a lot of inspiration and I will also post the link to Pinterest below the video so there you can also find a lot of uh, pictures of the papers and uh, uh, projects made with them. So here is my next project with a sweet baby collection from uh, Pion Design and I made a sort of a photo frame mini album. So this can be hanged on a wall and then you can change uh, the cars here for pictures of the baby. So I will show you a bit uh, of the frame first and then uh, the album inside. So uh, um, to make uh, this uh, box here I um, just uh, made a box uh, like normal and uh, just not, didn't uh, glue anything on the side and then I cut out uh, shipboard around uh, and uh, cut out the frame here so uh, maybe you can see a bit on it on the top here so and then I used uh, the Martha Stewart um, uh, French I showed in the previous uh, video with, with the Sweet Baby collection um, and that's a punch around uh, the page to create this doily around and this uh, lace is uh, from uh, Creative Scrapping and uh, here are some flatback pearls from uh, Wild Orchid Crafts and uh, here I cut out uh, this stork so and this had a um, uh, blue bow here, so I just painted it white and went over with uh, some uh, pink uh, uh, marker here to color it in so it fits a girly uh, album or a theme. So, and on the top here, I cut out some uh, butterflies and I uh, have some stamens behind here. And uh, this I cut, cut all the way in on the side so I can form it a bit. And um, for the hanging here, here I have um, uh, made a bow from seam binding and a wild orchid crafts flower and some cheesecloth and pearl string and uh, these leaves are from my stash and uh, yeah and also have a hanging here and here it says it's a girl and that's a dye from Sherry Lynn so this is hanging down when it's uh, hanging on the wall so uh, inside here you can uh, uh, take out a frame like so and uh, place a picture inside and uh, this can also be, f uh, be flipped around so you can use this side too. So here I have some tags and uh, a little christening um, dress for a little girl. Place some, uh, some uh, lace behind here and I made a bow here. And this die is from Cottage a Cut. So, uh, and I haven't um, um, bound them together. I'm not sure I will, but if I do, I will just bind it here. But then when you flip the album, one side will be upside down. So I think maybe I will leave it like so. And uh, here is another one. And here I placed them. Um, doily behind and this is a Sherry Lindai and some fussy cutting here and this uh, I layered several times this uh, little baby in a book here so it's uh, popped up a bit and uh, fussy cut out this dark and here is uh, just a little tag for some decoration or like a journal behind and uh, on the back side here here I made a pocket and uh, some fussy cut from the paper and this is a spellbinder style, so it's just for some fun and some decoration. And you can do some journaling here, or place a photo here and journal here. So, and here I have some baby clothes hanging, and this is also cut it, uh, cut, uh, cut it, uh, cut style. And I um, can take it out here. Also have a little pocket here, so I can place a tag inside here if I want to. So, and um, it's hanging on some crocheted uh, trim here. And on the back is some uh, 
um, C6 um, tags. And this is full notes, so this is supposed to go in here. And this is uh, Martha Stewart uh, bow die. And this is uh, stepping up die. And this I also cut out with uh, Martha Stewart die. And uh, placed some Waldorfer um, Crafts uh, lace behind. Maybe I zoom in a bit here so I see it better. So, and so. And uh, for the next year, here I cut out the frame. And uh, I've saved all the insides here, so it's a place on the back, so uh, the receiver will know how uh, big to cut uh, the pictures. Because I first I had it open, but then it wouldn't slide so easy. And so, and here is also a pocket, and it's a Martha Stewart punch, so you can slide the tag inside here. And this uh, leaf here is from uh, Charlene Dai. And on the back here. This is uh, La La Land die, I think, <laughs> if I'm not mistaken. And a little pocket here. And some lace trim here from uh, Creative Scrapping. So, and um, to make this shape here, I used uh, this uh, Tim Holtz. It's a uh, file tabs, and it's um, on the edge uh, die. So here you get uh, both, both the middle and uh, the side. So, yeah, the next one here, here is uh, C6 die and I cut out the border from uh, the paper collection and uh, these I don't remember now but maybe it's a Joycraft die, I'm not sure. So, and on the back side you can place a photo and this is a memory box die and cut out the butterfly. Just a C6 uh, die cut out here and a stamping up punch here. So you can write something here. And uh, yeah, I showed the back side. And for the next here is a photo frame by C6 and I used my Apple uh, Maker here. And um, it's a perfect pulse. And uh, here I have a little uh, envelope and it's a C6 die. And throughout all this uh, album here I used white um, cardstock from Basil. And a bow again here and, uh, from Martha Stewart and Stepping Up Punch. And here is a Spellbinder's uh, frame die and uh, these small angels or cherubs I cut out from the paper line. And some uh, lace here from Creative Scrapping. So this can be displayed in uh, different ways. You can put them in, in uh, as you like or uh, a photo you want to show. So you can change it for every day or week or so. So on the back side here, yeah, I see I forgot to put in, but uh, here I will put all the cutouts uh, so uh, they know uh, the shape of it or uh, the size. So it can be put inside here. And here you can see the hanging here, so this I just glued behind the paper. So this uh, box is about one inch uh, wide here. So I had a really time, a fun time making this and uh, yeah. And uh, uh, I can show you what I meant with the album. If I bind it together like so, then it will on this side be upside down, but then you can flip it. So. I'll see what I do. So uh, thank you so much for watching everyone and uh, have fun creating. Take care. Bye bye.